So then along the lines of this of the 3D pen tool, what, what is this here? Oh, that's added line on the avatar, right? There is this this thing, and Christina, you probably know more about this than than I do, because it's a sewing technique. I understand. It's the the thing that sounds painful, Steve. It's the uh, slash and spread, spread and slash, slash and spread. This is the one. So this is very. It's it's similar. It goes into the same realm. That I don't know how to use it actually. Click on a segment to draw the slash lines. Right, okay, so like from here to here, right? So this um, this does that, it does the cutting, but it also then inserts fabric somehow. Does that, was that how that works? Because I'm not, I'm not entirely sure how it works. I've, I've, <laughs> I, can, I can see the potential immediately, and maybe I should start with the with the whole piece that we can then slash and spread and see how that tool works. That is, oh wow indeed, Steve, absolutely. And this is how they make really interesting shapes very quickly. So I think in, in real life, what you do, say you had a really simple skirt and you wanted to make it a bit more interesting. You, you take scissors and you cut line into the, into the skirt anywhere or into the shirt. And then you physically take other material and then you sew it into what you've just um, just um, slashed and then you spread it out with other material and you get these ex super exciting uh, shapes that way to add fullness okay I, I can see this as a super exciting creativity tool <gasps> single click at the line at the top let me just go get rid of this here and then we just go and make uh, make another square underneath here like one that is you know whole as such and we just go pop that on here. We do that. Excellent. It's a hack and slash tool. What's it called again? Slash and spread. There we go. So single click at the top. <laughs> My mom also loves this software. It is just so cool to do this. Single click the line at the top. Then single click the bottom line. Then select the side you want to rotate and rotate it outside. Okay, I'll just I'll just do this somewhere here, here, and here. Then select the side, like either here or there. Okay, get you, yeah. And then you rotate it outside, like so. And click. Ha ha! Excellent. So we've just added a really odd piece of fabric there on the inside. Oh great! Let me do some more. That is so cool. Slash and spread. So, right, right, that adds the fullness. God, this is an ideal skirt tool then. So from here to there, click, then you select that side and you just go like that. Boom. <laughs> Fantastic. And all of a sudden you get these, these things that you could just never draw in 2D and, and make sure they work properly. Ha! That's amazing, Christina. Let me try and add some more fullness on the outside here. What's the shortcut key for that? Does it have one? Fullness. And now we want to use this and do that. Oh, that is easy. <laughs> wow. This is how these cracks do super exciting things in 10 seconds. And you go, oh my god, how did you do that? Just because they don't know how they, they, they know what they're doing. Can you also take uh, stuff away like this? Is that yes? That no? Oh no, that's. I think I broke it. Ugh. That that is not how you use that. <laughs> you got things hanging off and stuff. No, let's not do that. That's uncool. So always then go and put it on the outside. But I suppose I can use it the other way round. Not that I would see. You know, not that I would want that. But if I do that, and now I do that, and then I do that, I can do that. Yes, I, I see. I see. I mean that. I understand that doesn't make that much sense, but <laughs> because that poor line up here is still connected to all this poor line up here. One is straight and one's super wonky, so <laughs> uh, that is how you add fullness to a skirt or to a cape. Very cool. Ha! Huh. A beautiful toy to play with. Slash and spread. 
then select that, then you, well, then you select that, and then you do that. Fullness be here. And super exciting shapes. Ha! Huh, Christina, wonderful. <laughs> Let's try that next. Take fullness away. Well, let's go. Let's try uh, something like a hundred meter width. So that'd be very full. And let's see if we can take fullness away with the same tool. That would be cool. Since now we haven't added it. Make a rectangle, make it smaller. All right. Uh, let's see. So from... Let's go, let's try the middle here. From here to here. Or like from here to there, rather. Uh, yeah, it is this side, isn't it? And then we go and do this, essentially. Oh yeah, there's this thing at the bottom here. I suppose you can always cut that off, or how do you deal with that? I'm not sure if that's actually how you do it, so... <laughs> Let me try again. That, that was... <laughs> I'm not sure if that was correct here. <laughs> Usually you'd also not take that quite that much away, I would imagine. Can you extend the line as well? Is that possible? From here to there? No, it has to hit the bottom line, I guess. And then we take this and we do that. Yeah, I see, I see. So if I do it less dramatic, then there's no overlapping lines. From here to there, with that side, you do that. And now it's a curve at the bottom. Right, right, and that is how these overlapping lines... Yeah, yes, 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 yes. Oh, take fullness away, look at that! Let's take more fullness away from here to there with that side and then you just go like that fullness at the top less at the bottom now that is exciting stuff do you do a straight line and then you spread it mm -hmm. <laughs> totally having fun with this christina very nice this was actually a really cool Christmas present. I was thinking a little bit like uh, what what you said, what you did. You said, "Hey, do you know what? I uh, I'm gonna go and and invest into this. It's it's just it's, if you're having fun with a toy, great. That's you know that's that's just nice. Look at that fullness at the top and less at the bottom. I find that fascinating. <laughs> fascinating stuff. <laughs> 